Um, I just got really happy news that you did a panel. Not only did you do a panel, which is a huge thing in and of itself, but with Adore Delano, are you serious? Uh, honey, I panelled with Adore Delano. It happened. It's huge. It, are you, uh, the flow was so good. I worked through all her like infamous quotes no. and just asked her like what that meant, like why she said it, what that meant, like why she said it at the time. So we started with like her birth. You know, like, I'm a fucking Libra. <laughs> then we went, talked about her pop idol days. Oh and then we spoke about season t- six and then All Stars. And she told us that um, when she was on All Stars, her dad had recently passed away. And that was why she found, like, it such a struggle and literally didn't want to be there. Um, and then we spoke about X on the Beach, which is hilarious as well. And then we invited this ten-year-old kid up on stage, who asked Adora a question. It was it was adorable. That is so cute. It was cute. Do you remember the question? Uh, oh God, what was the question? I think the question was about style. Like oh, they wanted to like uh, like adopt some of Adora's style. They were like, I don't want to be like a drag drag queen. I want to be more punk, which oh is uh, you know. It's a vibe. This is yes, why I got the, the pinstripe so on. Yeah, it's good. Latex came off, pinstripe on. Yeah, no, but I, with always with the big hair, we can't we can't forget the hair, honey. Yes, is it heavy? Oh yeah, it's like, heavy. Does it not like hurt? Uh, my my suitcase was ten kilograms overweight. It was I a hefty bill. I don't know how many pounds that would be. Uh, can we get a conversion rate? Ten kgs to pounds, please. <laughs> I would know that, but I don't. But either way, I'm sure it's very heavy. Why would you know that? Why would I? Yeah. Because you are in metric. Yeah, we learned it in sixth grade, though. We had to do all the conversions, and I forgot. Sorry. (laughs) But either way, very heavy. Um. So, are you here all three days? Uh, yes. I'll be at DragCon, just hanging about. Came for the panel. Came for the party. Uh, gonna do some little performances as well. I sing opera, so that's my thing. Yeah. Well, yeah, I want to hear. I almost failed to ask, so you were like a bit hung up, but you know what? Il dolce suono mi colpire suono Thank you. Oh, it, <laughs> it always does go silent. That was amazing. Thank, Thank you, you for giving us a little taste. Oh, anytime. Honey. Are you um? Do you kind of brand yourself or like market yourself as like um drag queen like who does opera? Because I know Ginger Minch has started do started doing that recently. So uh, I try kind of brand myself as like a musician first, okay. then a drag queen. Okay. Um, I enjoy doing drag a lot, but like it's, I love bringing like the two together and being able to use like, you know, because I'm not a professional opera singer. You sure sound like you are. I have, I didn't do like the years and years that it takes to make it as an opera singer. So, you know, probably not a big wig and everyone thinks it's fabulous, right? (laughs) I think it's fabulous. I think you're fabulous. Oh, you're thank awesome. You. Thank well, you too, Maddie. Yeah. Thank you so much for talking to us. Um, do you want to plug your Instagram, Twitter, yeah, yeah, all yeah, yeah, that? Yeah. So Insta is uh, Ash underscore Kanazi. Uh, you can see all my opera. You can see the panel that I did. You can see uh, my podcast, which is called The Pink Room. Uh, we just did an episode with Adore Delano for the second season. <laughs> I love her. It was the best. It was so gorge. Um, and, yeah, come follow me. Come find out more. Oh, I definitely will be following Dude. you. I'm sure I'll see you around tomorrow when Sunday. We'll also be here. So. Yeah. Yeah, congratulations amazing. on all your success and amazing Thank voice. You. Amazing. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you.